Greetings there guys, Game of Jim here. Welcome to Project Perfect Citizen. This is a game about um, surveillance, you're a cop, and you're you're trying to tackle some cyber crimes and prevent crimes. It's, a, it's quite an interesting game, but I'll just get straight into it. Um, logging in. This is another one of those games that is like a fake PC, and I really like that sort of style. <laughs> so, this is our, our screen, this is our login. Um, because it's DCPS, so this is our, our police's computer. Um, that's actually, that's the real time and date, so that's quite interesting. Um, welcome to your new job at DCPS. I, I'm guessing that's like a D D Dorset County Police Surveillance. I'm Fluffy, your automated training assistant. <laughs> this guy's like um, Clippy. Um, if you don't even remember Clippy. He's a pretty cool guy, and I really wish the new Windows they just came out and said, Guys, we're bringing back Clippy. He's a cool guy, and everyone liked him. Uh, even though the wizard was much better. Okay, so, if you uh, need to review after the training simulations, just open the help menu. Okay, so this is um, the beginning level. So, opening emails. Uh, so, let's read through these. Oh, God, this looks like a tongue twister. Let's see how far I get. Project Perfect Citizen is the first extensive program initiated by the Department of Cyber Police and Security, tasked with the job of detecting and eradicating cyber criminal threats within our great nation's network. This network, the Secure Network, is a series of interconnected links between every electronic tele <laughs> I got so far. telecommunications devices internationally that control the channels through which information is passed. Jesus! Huh! Ah, I suppose I got that far. So that's just from the automated system. This is from Rex Davis. Hey, new guy. I wanted to drop in and say hi. I'm just a few cubicles away. Anyway, just take it easy the next few days. And don't worry, if things start to seem overwhelming, I'm sure your first assignment will be easy. Uh, just remember, I know things. Okay. And this is... Janelle Pax. So you are the new personnel here at DCPS. Well, I know you're going to enjoy your time here. I know it. Anyways, I'm Janelle Pax and I'm your boss here. Uh, and then it says, open my graph application. Um, just remember, with every successful takedown, we're closer to achieving the goal of perfect citizen. So I think, what is perfect citizen? That's what the game's called, by the way. It was Project Perfect System, wasn't it? Okay, let's open a graph thing, because that's what the email said. This is the pipeline extraction application, okay? Um, use it to analyze groups of interconnected people. We will then further investigate a target from this group. Let's go with some basics. Try selecting a photo. Let's look at this bold guy. Hey, dude, how's your day? Great, man, thanks for asking you. Pretty good. That's these guys. Um, okay, so, oh, we created a connection, cool, please close and relaunch the application, okay, so we need to create connections between these guys, so DL is talking to LX, so, there's a connection there, who else is um, LX talking to, he's talking to KQ, and KQ is talking to LX as well, yeah, and he's talking to VN, and VN is talking to DL. So we got a nice um, a square here. Now, uh, you've created a connection. You need to color code them. So, innocent connections should be red, green, and suspicious ones red. Okay, so we need to now go through all these talks and see if they're suspicious or not. Low turnout, getting poached. Where are they at? Second and broach. Taking care of it. Alright, <laughs> that's what they sound like. Who's KQ? KQ speaks like that. Um, so that's red, obviously. DLVN. Hey now, I just wanted to let you know I'll be in town this weekend. Oh sweet, let's hang out. Definitely. That's innocent. Hey dude, how was your day? Good, thanks for asking. You? Pretty good. Suspicious. That's not suspicious. Though, I've got to say, I think there's some connection here. I think he's coming on to uh, Alex there. 
And why would you not? Look at this handsome fella. <laughs> Alright, how do you get these photos, by the way? Anyway. Hey, did you get the shipment? Oh, very suspicious. Did you get my shipment? Uh, yeah, sold it. Made bank. Very suspicious. Uh, we want to target the most suspicious person. Which is obviously KQ, because he's, he's in two of these conversations. Yours, most suspicious guy. Let's submit it. Beginning, phase two. Okay. Well. Right, so we're now exploring the target's desktop. I need to decide if the charges should be pressed against them. Stop reading the emails. Okay. Grocery list. Okay, it's just a normal grocery list. Um, it's like spam to me. Just scan the bottom for this weird code. Um, no, nah, it just looks like a Hoover. Um, vacuum. Yeah, it's just a vacuum. Who's the buy? Boiling Wizard at Empire.net. Who's this by? Uh, wait, that's their email. This is by Peculiar.com and Dustblaster.com. Hell yeah. Oh. Precision bombing techniques. Hmm. Slightly, slightly a bit suspicious here. To take down the embassy, you're going to need to place the charges at the base of six or more stabilizers. They're going to build a building. Okay, right. So we're looking for some sort of bomb thing. See documents, downloads, pictures, terrorism. Looks like some normal files to me. Default files, maybe, maybe downloads. Blueprints. There's everything on here. That's not a blueprint. It's a gun picture. <laughs> okay, let's check out the other one. Terrorism. What's in here? What is the nation? What nation is our target? Great password. Great password. Um, babes, obviously. Big guy. Hmm. Oh, it's a gun. Disappointing, dude. Come on. It's the same picture you used earlier. More guns. Like every folder in here is guns. Selfies. Okay. Sexy dot JPEG. Damn straight. Let's leave that open. <laughs> Sexy dot JPEG. Um. What else we got? Documents. Uh, for my eyes only. Terrorism. Germany. Okay, is that the password? Gravity Firestorm. It's the password here, isn't it? Maybe it's something, something else. Okay, um... He's got a lunch of... A, a bunch of uh, passwords here. I said lunch. You can ignore that, though. Uh, let's try Germany then. Enter. Okay, right, so they have some a folder here. Notes and schematic. Let's check our notes. The plan. Okay. Yeah, so they have three plans here to blow up the building. And three locations. Oh dear. <laughs> Uh, hopefully it's not too late. A manual for making bombs. Logging in. Okay. So this is a, apparently a, a manual to make bombs. I'll flag that. One, once per desktop you can ask for a colleague's opinion on a file. Okay. Um, right click the file. Scan. <laughs> index of 10. The more strong evidence you find, the better our chances of getting a conviction. Okay, let's, um... Yeah, that's also suspicious. Scan that as well. Yeah. Instructions. I think... I don't think these are... That bad. I mean, it is a 3D printed gun, but uh, I mean, I don't know where this is. This is very suspicious to me. I said scan sexy or JPEG. Only one? Come on. Oh, I suppose. Look at those damn eyes. Let's put the plan in there as well. I want to scan it. Yeah, okay, submit. The dummy was busted. <laughs> yeah. 
there, there was a fair bit of evidence there. So that was the um, operation, the dummy one. Okay, let's check our emails. Uh, your simulation run, perfect score, excellent. Okay, I oh, thank you, Rex. Yeah, he did the same. Oh, stop bragging. Graph. Okay, let's find some connections. Well, obviously this this lady here, she's the most suspicious. So there's some eerie music going on. She's got six emails. Welcome. I'm glad you're reaching out, reaching out to us. I'm Chandler Garvey, a long-time member of the Virtue community. I'll be your sponsor. It's my job to act as a resource when you need someone to talk to. Um, many of us were abused in the past, and some of us are recovering abusers. This group began our traditional therapies, 12-step. Uh, as behavioral. Okay, so she, she's in rehab. Finding this group is a real windfall for me. I never thought I'd get the chance to talk to anyone about my email, illness. Um, I'd like to share a bit about myself. I've never acted on these desires, and I never will. Okay, not very suspicious. Trouble. You told me to be a candid with you, Chandler. So, in person I'm feeling guilty for something. I found some. I found some blank. Um, am I wrong for looking at them? For keeping them? There was a line, and we don't cross it. Help me understand why. No, Murphy, corrupted. Or remove yourself from the Virtue Club. Am I being clear? Ooh, that's a bit weird. Hated to deliver the news. Was arrested Thursday. He thought he told me it's true. He could have been looking at 25 to life. And I decide every minute he serves. He deserves every minute he serves. Self-control, community, family. These are things that keep us from failing ourselves and acting on temptation. Ooh, I'm getting some strong um, vibes. Evil vibes. Lisa and I have been together for a while. She loves Proust, Nabovk, and Kafk. Kafka. And better yet, she understands them in ways I'd never imagined myself. Her analysis is full of sharp and in insight and delightful twists. God, I love her. I think I have to tell her the truth. Or if she hates me, if she leaves me, I don't know. He says, open up to her. Um, talking about my father. Old shame. I can barely say his name aloud. Arthur Goodwin is in the ground. He has no power over you. That's the father then. Uh, and about your shame, you've got to let it go. You were a child. How could you have helped what happened to you? How could you have helped what happened to you? Oh, dear. Um, so she's obviously been abused. Abused. Um, look at her files. My folder. My love. Uh, I love is someone, isn't it? Who is it? Um, Lisa. What's in here then? Private files. Dad. Dad is, um, he worked it out as well. Um, Arthur Goodwin. Trouble with DXT. Uh, you told me what. You told me to be a candid with you, Chandler, so I will. While I've never acted on my impulses in person, I feel guilty for something. I found some pictures online. Am I wrong for looking at them? For keeping them? Delete those pictures immediately. There's a line, we don't cross it. Can't understand why. Isn't looking at photos a victimless crime? Someone hurt those children. Oh dear. And what you're viewing is a product of that violence. By having it on your computer, you're participating, even uh, contributing to it. You're complicit in the black market predicated on violating children. Remove those pictures. Are those pictures here? I think they're gone. Alright, I'll get it. I'll delete them. Looks like she has on the road sunset. Guess he did this road trip. Yeah, those look fine. Oh, and check them all. Back. Robert's party. Crazy fun. Toast. 
Ah, food. Oh, that's a weird desk. These are all right. Nothing really that bad. Action stop. Okay, playing football. Some good pictures here. They look like stock photos. Are there? My daughter. My daughter. She's got a daughter? We haven't found anything on the daughter yet. Uh, so we need to find out there. And I was in Private Files Soccer Day. Other. Okay. Lit. Here's a confession here. Uh, Jesus Christ, this is long. What is this? I'm not reading all that. Some weird... I don't know what this is. Are they like Bible verses? They don't look like, don't look like verses. Family photos. Maybe we can find some pictures of the... Uh, yeah, there's a daughter. Just scanning them for names. Welcome home. New bed. I can't read that. Okay, so there's, there's a picture of the daughter. We can use that to uh, get into those private files. Soccer day. Other. My daughter. A N N A. L I. It looks like analyze. Is that right? I'm probably reading that wrong. Welcome to the text. I'm glad you reached us. Finding this group has been a real windfall for me. I suffer from a twisted sexuality, relived by it all, delivered to me by my father. I can't help but be attracted to children. Jesus. Oh no. I found your hidden photos. I cannot be dis begin to describe the pain that this causes me. Disgust and empathy is a strange combination. I know you're trying, but this is proof you're not trying hard enough. If you are not strong enough to delete these on your own, maybe you're strong enough not to seek them out. Um, I wanted to help you. I wanted to be here for you. I will not allow myself to enable you. Oh, Lisa found them. Shit. Oh dear. So this is, this actually I can't really find. This is the only thing here. But there's not really much. I'm going to submit that, I think. Can we scan that? Yeah, okay. I did have these pictures. And so I can submit that and I can imagine it. Which one is the. Um, welcome, 60. Scan. Yeah, that's a 10 as well. I'll flag that. Um. Trouble. Might as well put that in there as well. Let's we'll scan that. Yeah, okay. Submit. So we've convicted this person probably. More than enough. Okay, so we, we brought them to trial. Yeah. It probably wasn't safe to keep him around this child. Keep him around, around the child. But I mean, this is quite... <laughs> This is quite deep some stuff here. This isn't light. This is... This is difficult. Just doing my job. We hope to see more from you. Okay. Next time it's on the graph. Okay, it's important to go through people's desktop so you can find scum like that and reach out. 
something like that out of our reach. What? So we can get the scum like that out of the reach of our children. Okay. I still cannot believe that person like that was a teacher. Shit. Yeah, that was good bus then. Piss of work. Okay, cool. So we got them. All right. So that's all we have time for today. Thanks for watching. If you want to play this game, uh, I'll put the link in the description. It's actually a really long game and it continues. It's a little bit buggy. Uh, so I did carry on playing after this, but it crashed and I lost my progress. So I'm not really willing to play it again. But if you really, guys really like it, I, I will try and continue. Um, I do have the next mission completed and recorded. Uh, I just need to know if you guys want to watch it. Thanks for watching again. Um, see you in the next one. Goodbye.